Hey everybody, it's me Arlene, Delicious Delights, and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be sniffing for the very first time Amouage Blossom Love. This is one that I have been wanting to test for a very long time, but for some reason I just kept on putting it off. Finally, I have a sample here, and I'm very much looking forward to trying this one. So I don't really know too much about this. The only thing that I know is that it's a cherry blossom scent. And you can see here, there's a beautiful cherry blossom artwork here. And I'm kind of on the hunt for the best Holy Grail cherry blossom perfume. There is one that I really do like from Costume National, and it's called J. Um, but I'm not sure if that's like the best one that I've ever tried. So I'm hoping that this is really nice. And let's see here. Oops, it popped out says here a floral trail of cherry blossom creating an olfactive romance with everlasting passion so it's an edp marketed for women i don't know what the notes in here but uh but i do know that it's a cherry blossom perfume let's put that down so let's get this on a test strip these are just my first impressions obviously okay Hmm. Wow, all right, so what I'm getting here right away is a pink floral bouquet. If I didn't know that there was cherry blossom in here, I'm not sure if I would guess cherry blossom right away, but I am picturing a beautiful, big, pink flower bouquet and um, there is some sweetness in here and I'm also picking up on some muskiness so for me it's a musky fruity floral it's gorgeous <laughs> I'm picturing a geisha girl or geisha woman I'm not sure how to say it. it's a geisha woman <laughs> where she's walking in a Japanese garden with her beautiful uh, traditional clothing kimono and um, it's snowing outside and then you have the cherry blossom trees in bloom in the winter if that's possible <laughs> but yeah this is very very nice very elegant there is a sweetness that I'm picking up on here as well that's reminding me a little bit of bubble gum but definitely not in an, in an immature way or a youthful way. This is, for me, a mature smelling fruity floral. And again, the musk in here as I'm smelling it on the test strip, it's, it's quite noticeable. So let's see what the notes are in this one. I'll just uh, pull it up here. This is what the bottle looks like. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this before stunning very bright pink and then the notes in uh, blossom love by emma waj well first of all it was released in 2017 and the notes in the top are heliotrope and bergamot the middle notes are amaretto cherry blossom ylang ylang and rose and the base notes are tonka bean vanilla suede and amber and it's gorgeous. <laughs> uh, there aren't any musky notes in here, but I'm, I'm definitely getting a muskiness for sure. Coming from something. Mina Chords, vanilla, floral, almond, fruity, powdery, amber, sweet, fresh, and rose. So, yeah, this is something that I'll definitely be testing further to see how it develops on my skin. I really love Amouage Sunshine from the same collection, and I also really love Lilac Love, the purple one. So, yeah, this one I like too. <laughs> so anyways, that was my video, my first impressions and first sniff of Blossom Love. I'd love to hear your opinion on this if you've tried it. Thanks so much for tuning in, and I'll see you guys soon in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.